With any images you have on your page, you can also optimize certain elements of those. If we minimize this for a moment, on the desktop here, I've got a graphic, and I've, I've given it a name to also include keywords there. In this case, it's Play Poker, and it's a bitmap, so Play Poker. So if, we, if I click, hold, and drag that into Explorer, That's the graphic I'll be, I'll be using in this case. So let me minimize Explorer. And if we go back to the page I'm working on, how to play poker.html. So let's, put, let's add that image to the page here, below the second heading. So standard HTML image tag source equals play with well, the name of the graphic play dash poker dot bmp and then how you can make the make the page even more optimized is include the alt tag so I'll show you exactly what that does in a moment if you're not familiar with it but in a nutshell alt is text that appears if the if the picture can't be displayed for any reason so alt equals and then some alternative text so you can create some descriptive text of the graphic and also include more keywords there for example learn how to play poker successfully with our handy guide Okay. Again, you don't want to overdo the keywords, and checking the keyword density of your page should allow you to see if the, if you've you know overdone it at any point. So it is walking a fine line of having the keyword phrase you want in there very prominent throughout the document, but also not overdoing it so Google doesn't penalise you for you know stuffing the keyword in too many times. OK, so let's save that. But back to Internet Explorer. File open. OK, our document how to play poker. Let's open that. And that's how it's looking now. The headers, the graphic now, and the, let's say, the body text. So there's our graphic, and it's displaying fine, but if I hold the mouse over it, our alt text pops up, as you can see. And if the graphic can display for any reason, and actually let me demonstrate that now, if I minimize Explorer, and minimize Notepad, there's the graphic, let me delete it. OK, back to Explorer, and let me refresh this page. The picture doesn't display, but we get the alt text. So it's handy from a user's, from a visitor's point of view, but it's also very handy by including the keyword phrase there, or, you know, specific useful keywords. It's good for the search engines as well. So that's another point to bear in mind when creating your page with the search engines in mind.